Hey Marvel fans, welcome back to Tori Talks with Dr. S. I'm Tori, this is Dr. S. Let's discuss Agatha All Along, Episode 7, Death's Hand in Mine, and my favorite episode so far. This was so good. Yes, I agree. It's this going to get better and better now. Has to. I feel like the first few, it was all the mystery, like what's going on here? It's all cryptic. And then, boom, we get the reveal of who Teen is, and now it's just, like, amazing. The, it was so well written, shot, acted by especially Patti Lapone. So, really, this was just Lilia's story of yes. her, well, her end. But it's more to that. But, but So, basically, we get this linear episode. It's kind of bounces all over the place. And it's her... And we're with her on her scattered journey through time. Mm -hmm. It goes from the beginning when she's little and she's learning how to read tea leaves with her uh, instructor, I, Maestra, I, I, don't yes. know, I guess is what you want to call it. And then she's in the underground tunnels with Jen and then she's doing tarot. I mean, it's, it's all over the place. It, is, it was so mind-blowing to try to follow it all. Yes. But then it was so well put together. But also well done, right? Yes. yes. Like I didn't understand it, like... I couldn't explain it, yeah. but I understood it at, like, a visceral level. Right. Like, it all makes sense now, even though it's all crazy. Usually I get frustrated on, when things like that happen, mm -hmm. when they do too many flashbacks or flash yes. forwards or whatever, yes. but this one was really well executed. And we had seen it all in other episodes, and it just, it wove together, like, really well. Very convincing. Yeah. They're like, oh, that's so good. It explains all the random outbursts, because she's been experiencing the road basically out of order this Imagine whole time. if you lived your life like that. Yeah. Like, that's Ouch. insane. But um, basically, I mean, I can't say like philosophically what the message is, but she's basically been fearing death because, well, she, everybody died in her coven so long mm -hmm. ago. But I almost felt like she was sensing, though, that it was near. So the, the closer she could tell she was getting to it, the more scared she got, I guess. But um, And the more episodes she had then? Of, yeah. Yes, like yeah. it was... It was, you know, Building. impending. Yeah. Yes. Um, but anyway, and, and then it all makes sense with the, her f um, falling. And uh, yes. anyway, it was... Oh, the falling. Oh, and the way she was reading the tarot, and yes. she thought it was it was for Billy, who his question was great. Am I Billy or am I William? Yeah. Great question, but for another time, right? <laughs> so right now, this is all about you, Lilia. And then she draws the card, and then the most awesome... It was really sad, was... She figures it out. It's mm -hmm. supposed to be her tarot reading. And then she gets the little girls out, and then she's just says her goodbye, and she's like, I loved being a witch. I mean, oh, my gosh. I know. You knew she was making a sacrifice. Yeah. Oh, yes. It was so sweet. Mm -hmm. Sacrifice for her coven. Yes. But, um, and then when she takes that upside-down tower card and flips oh, it that upright. Was so satisfying. And takes out the Salem Seven. Yes. Are they gone though? They're dead, right? Oh, I think they're I, dead. Okay. She really saved them in more ways than one. But because mm -hmm. um, I don't have to worry about the Salem Seven on their tail. Yeah. But I don't know if they even know that they're dead. Yeah. But then she ultimately is gone. And you knew she was gonna fall because yeah. of all the falling. That's what was so well done. Because we had seen that image of her masterpiece. And then, oh, really, gosh. like one of the best episodes I've ever seen of yeah. any television yeah. series. Um, I thought it was really cool how they uh, revealed who Rio really is because. Mm -hmm. Lilia was just telling Jen down in the tunnels that, uh, what is it, death comes for all of us, mm -hmm. something like that. And then right af after she says that, here's Rio, and then it's revealed yes. that she's death. But yes. we just got a little bit, but a lot of the people that watch, they've been saying that she's death. Did they say yes. Miss Death? Is it just death? I don't know. Like they just Grim said, Reaper death? They just said death in the show, right? Cause yes. Because I guess just death as a concept? Yeah. I yeah. thought this is a character named Miss Death or yeah. something like that, but... <laughs> I guess that's it. I don't know. But, and then how Agatha was like, yeah, I mean, I like the she, bad boys. That's what yes, she said. Yeah. yeah, she made a couple little comments like that where, like, you know, that whole, like, they obviously were lovers in the past. And she, like, so, knew all along, obviously, Yeah, she right? knew all along. Agatha, what are you doing? Gosh, yeah. she's, she's a little brat. Yeah. No, she's, she's just not, she's, she's not out for a good herself. Person. I know. She's just, yeah, why do I even we, think Why? That she, we've known her to be this way yeah. the whole time we've known she's her. She's not supposed to be, so I don't no. know why I keep thinking I know. that way. Because but the main characters, we're supposed to identify with them and, like, root for them. Which makes then we're like, the fools. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. What did you think about, um... They're what they were wearing. So what, what, Billy was Maleficent, I believe, and then she was the Wicked Witch of the East. Well, she was the Bad Witch, yes. and then Lilia was the 
Glinda the Good Witch. Yes. And then I think that Jen was from Snow White, the witch from Snow White. I don't know. I the could be wrong. Local, like the old lady witch? Yeah, with yeah, the yeah. apple. I was yes, waiting yes, for her to like, hold an mm-hmm, apple. Mm-hmm. But that was kind of cool. Yeah, I did like that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But anyway, um, even my husband was like, after we the episode ended, he's like, that was a really good episode. Yeah. It was really well done. Yes. I want to watch it again. Like yeah. last week's and this week. Like, oh, it's just so good. I mean, you can't waste somebody like Patty Lapone. I mean, she I, there had to be bigger things for her, so this mm-hmm. makes sense. But yes. anyway, so, so good. Um, do you have anything else to add? No, I just can't wait to see more. Like, are we going to find Tommy? Yes. I mean, we are, right? That's just like, I don't know. I feel does like he that even was want to be Billy also? Like, does he even want to be Billy? doesn't sound like it. I don't know. Yeah, how does this yeah, end? I don't know. Because this has but to the, go along with the rest of the Marvel universe yeah but i don't know i don't know anything about it so i'm really excited to know but like intriguing what does he want but who would he want to be though because he doesn't even know william does he know william though because he doesn't even know who that was like he just knows that's who the body is his body well he's because he's been playing the role like those are his parents right like but like he's been faking it he doesn't actually maybe he likes his life that way i don't know i know it's very but with all those powers now provoking he can't really just go back to being somebody he doesn't know yeah but they're not even supposed to be real. It's also... It's... Ouch. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> My head. Anyway. All right, everybody. Let us know what you thought of this amazing episode. Comment below, and we will see you next week. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Who's been messing up everything?